What's happening, guys? We are with one of my absolute favorite people in the world, and I mean that. I, I call this man a friend. This is Bob from R Finder. Hey, guys, what's up? <laughs> he has he he has probably the most popular booth at Hamcation this year. Not only because you have this amazing R Finder phone, it's DMR and it's a cell phone, and FM, and you don't need to program no, code, no plugs code plugs and all that stuff. But code plugs, schmode plugs. What is this behind us, dude? Tell me what in the heck do we have going on here? We have resurrected the uh, portable rotation as L rotator, uh, which was discontinued about three years ago. Uh -huh. and we've resurrected it. Um, we've done some uh, enhancements to it. Uh, made it, uh, the board is a little bit more uh, robust um, uh -huh. for, um, uh, for continuous duty. This thing's been running for two days, for instance. And wow. No problems. And uh, also... Notice that it's, it's, it's moving right now. Yes, it's moving. It's actually like Bluetooth enabled now also. So we added Bluetooth to it. Wow. Um, and um, the idea is our finder is going to have the list of FM transponder satellites, and you'll be able to pick one on really? the list. Really? Yeah. Be able to pick like one in the list. app, in the on app, the phone, on the, on the radio, just on the R Finder. On the R Finder radio, and what it's going to do is, uh, when you pick the, the satellite, it'll change the frequency, swing the antenna to the to the uh, AOS azimuth, and follow the satellite's arc across the sky. And as it does, it'll adjust Doppler and stuff yeah. like that. So all automatic in your hand with the R Finder. Uh, so you're radio. controlling that antenna with the oh, R Finder correct. that's in your hand. Well, actually, it's controlled by that one over there on the chair. But okay, but but yes, if you had an R Finder in your hand, yes, it would control that. It'll control that. And then you can that. get on satellites. That's correct. Now the way we did it, um, you can also control it with uh, uh, like anything with Bluetooth. It uses the same command set as. Uh, as the Yesus, so anything that talks to Yesus should work. Mm -hmm. um, we're still in testing phases. It's, this is the only one that exists. It's a prototype. Yeah. So we're getting close by um, by Hamvention. We should have a bunch of them ready to go. Okay. Wow. All yeah. right. We're so we're that's, there. That's we're, what we're working. We're on, on the cusp. We're on the we're on the hairy edge of. Uh, portable uh, as L rotator in a bag, ready to go. She runs on 12 volts. Wow. So, so let me clarify, because I'm not a big satellite guy. Mm -hmm. I'm not a satellite guy at all. But, but basically, what you're saying is, with your R finder mm -hmm. and that antenna, yep. hold up your R finder with that radio right there. Yep. You control, and this automatically follows the azimuth and elevation, and it tracks the satellite. It tracks the satellite automatically. Automatically from. And the then device. you just use that little thing right there, and you're talking to Sats. And you're talking to Sats. That's a game changer, dude. I, I think we've. Uh, you just broke the internet. Yeah, pretty much. Now, you'll also be able to use this on like uh, sideband satellites, but you'll use okay. a different radio. But just use the yeah. uh, you use the R Finder app. Um, in the radio or on a Android or on an iPhone, mm -hmm. once we have the iPhone done, yeah. uh, you'll be able to uh, control it with so that. So you use also. the R Finder to control the antenna, control and it. then you hook a different radio up with the, to the right. antenna, right. Right. like a 9700 or something like that. Right, sideband or something, yeah. right, exactly. But it's Dude. perfect for like POTA events or for anything outdoor, or for, uh, you know, for uh, field days, winter field day, summer mm -hmm. field day. Uh, so Frank Jambri might be able to make a satellite contact Absolutely. now. Absolutely. Jamboree on the air. You know, whatever you're doing outside, man, you can have the greatest time yeah. now because, well, you can just kind of set it up in five to ten minutes. Uh, yeah. The, the, lo the long part is, is assembling the arrow antenna. but Sure. Yeah, but um, it's a you know, quick setup and uh, just turn the R, turn the R, the R Finder app on, choose the this rotator out of the list, and boom. Wow. Off it goes and it starts tracking. That's absolutely incredible, dude. Yeah. Well, you awesome. know what my mom says, right? What's that? You finally did something right. <laughs> After all these years. After all these years. Oh, man, that's so awesome. Bob, thanks so much for sharing this with us. Thanks. Don't forget the R Finder uh, uh, B1. You can get them at uh, rfinder.net. You can get them at, um, at Gigaparts, HRO, and it looks like we're going to be at uh, Bridgecom now and okay. at uh, DX Engineering. Nice. So, yeah, so uh, we're really uh, becoming 
mainstream. Yeah. Awesome, Built by dude. ham radios, by ham radio operators, for ham radio operators. It's, I think it's the only radio that any ham in recent memory has actually brought to market. You know, mm. not just a prototype, or yeah. uh, but actually uh, brought to market. So I feel pretty good about it. And thanks to everybody that's given us your, their support. Oh, you can find me on zoom.rfinder.net. Normally, if in my office, I've got an open door policy. Uh, Zoom is open on my desk. You can always come in and say hi or mm -hmm. have a cup of coffee. And that, you, like, you do that for tech support too. Like yeah, your customer oh, service yeah. is no, outstanding. No, absolutely. Thank you. Yeah, yeah, you can put actually Zoom on your device and share your screen with us. Like actually, mm. Zoom in with your device, share your screen if you got any questions or you want to know how to you know best practices or specific configurations or whatever. You can always uh, just uh, get us yeah. live. Yeah. So. Awesome. Sweet. And that's why he's one of my favorite people in the world. Thanks, Yo. Bob. 73. <laughs> Love you, buddy. See ya.